What RPA tool is the best? UiPath, Power Automate, Automation Anywhere, or Blue Pressing? Let's evaluate them. All four tools are leaders in the Gartner Magic Quadrant, which means they have been adopted by many companies and have successfully automated business processes. So, which tools should you choose for your company? I have been testing each of them and I definitely have my favorite. I'm Camilo Duarte, this is Base Robot. welcome. Let's start with UiPath, the market leader. UiPath offers a free version, which is their community edition. This version is not limited and you can do everything with it, but you can use it for productive work in companies. So, if you want to work with a productive version, you need to purchase licenses. They have the orchestrator or control group, which works from the web and is something that I personally find very good. So, well done for the orchestrator. They have a development environment that is primarily a desktop application which most people are familiar with and professionally use. However, they are moving more towards the cloud and already have a cloud-based studio version. So I imagine all these services will start migrating to the cloud. We will see how that goes. Programming languages. UiPath primarily supports c -sharp and Visual Basic .NET as the main programming languages. If you want to create expressions or manipulate data, you need to use these programming languages. Academy. They offer a comprehensive academy with functional and technical courses, all free. Certifications. UiPath provides free certifications for completing their courses, but if you want an official developer certification, you will need to pay for that. Accessibility. As I mentioned, you can use UiPath both on the web and on the desktop. The web version extends to multiple devices and the desktop version is limited to a Windows operating system. Price. This is where UiPath has a significant drawback. They are not very transparent with their pricing. On their website, they mention a starting plan at $420 per month, but this does not include unattended automations, which are typically what business look for. Furthermore, I found a website with price ranges. The annual license for UiPath Studio is between $2,000 and $3,000. Um, the orchestrator license costs $20,000, an attended robot costs 1,200. Yeah, you know, it's not transparent. And an unattended robot costs 8,000 each annually. Uh, these are all annual prices. As I mentioned, I cannot verify this information, but I'm providing you with these prices. From my experience, I can tell you that it is something similar. Now, let's talk about Power Automate, the new giant. It has a free version, yes, it does have a free version that we can access with our Office 365 subscription, however, if we don't have a subscription, we cannot access it, so it is free and not free at the same time. It has its tricks. Obviously, most companies work with Excel and they work with some Microsoft Suite, so it is probably free to try. Orchestration is done from the web. In this portal, we can execute, control, and monitor our automation, as well as create artificial intelligence models and perform process mining. Development. Power Automate has two automation modalities. The first one, flows that run in the cloud and are developed in the cloud, which are essentially APIs. These connectors allow us to create background automations. This is part of automation, but it is not what we directly know as RPA. If we want to do the development, which we know as RPA, which involves interacting with graphical interfaces and more, we'll have to do it in their desktop application. This means they offer both options. The cloud option only allows us to automate background flows, and the desktop option allows us to do all type of automations. Programming languages. Well, the programming language that Power Automate uses is expressions, which is like an Excel formula Personally, I don't like it that much. I would prefer to inject C Sharp or Visual Basic .NET code directly. However, it also allows running C Sharp or Visual Basic .NET code, so that's a plus. Academy. Microsoft offers a very robust academy, but honestly, it seems a bit disorganized to me. I've been trying it, doing different exercises, but their academy doesn't completely convince me. Certifications 
they have their official paid certification which is the PL500 and every time you complete those mini courses on the academy platform you get a mini certificate which I don't believe holds much significance. Accessibility we can access automation from both the web and the desktop, but if we want to modify desktop automations, we will have to open the desktop application. Price I feel that Microsoft deserves some applause here because their prices are quite transparent. They start at 15 per month and go up to 150 per month if you need attended robots. Something that other manufacturers don't offer thanks to this transparency in pricing and the great added value that Power Automate provides, it has become a rival that has taken a significant portion of the market. Blue Prism Blue Prison offers a kind of free version. More than a community version, it is a 90 day free trial for learning and a 30 day business trial. Frankly, this is a significant misstep in Blue Prison because many developers would prefer to learn a technology without the limitation of time. Orchestration Blue Prison has a desktop orchestrator and also a web orchestrator. To be honest, I've only worked with the desktop orchestrator and most of the companies I've worked with still use the desktop orchestrator. Web technology is something that is just now being implemented and Blue Prison is in this process of transitioning from being a 100% desktop application to migrating many of its services to the cloud. Let's see how that pans out. Development Blue Prism's development is primarily desktop based, although they now have a version called Blue Prism Cloud. I've tested this version very little, it functions as far as I've had the opportunity to try it. But to be honest, companies still work a lot with the desktop application. The future is also heading toward migration to the cloud. We will see how new or existing customers adapt to this shift to the cloud. But personally, I found desktop development very convenient, so it's a plus for Blue Prism. Programming languages Blue Prism primarily works with C Sharp and Visual Basic.NET, although you can inject other programming languages, so there's no issue with that. Academy the Academy offers good content and it is well organized. Certifications Certifications in Blue Prison are paid. I obtained my Blue Prison certification in person in Bogota. I literally went to a place where they put you in a small computer boat, set up a camera and they are quite strict with the, these certifications. Accessibility well, we can access Blue Prism either from the desktop or from the web, but they are separate. You either access from the desktop or from the web. There isn't the option of using both simultaneously. Price Both Blue Prism and UiPath do not display their prices directly on the web. They are not transparent with their pricing, however, on the website I mentioned where I saw UiPath's prices, it shows that Blue Prism offers a single type of license that grants users unlimited access to the company's available RPA products. According to the following table, for a buyer purchasing 1 to 10 licenses per year, they must pay $13,000, which gives us an approximately unit value of $1,300 per license. It seems they aim to attract more volume rather than focusing on the unit cost of the license. Now let's talk about Automation Anywhere. Automation Anywhere also offers a free version, a community version, where we can try out absolutely everything. The control room. Automation Anywhere orchestrates everything via the web. In fact, development is web-based as well, directly in the cloud in its modern versions. I understand that there's an older version of Automation Anywhere that one can develop on the desktop, and in fact, many of my friends work with this version in their companies. Shout out to all of them. Programming languages. The programming language used in Automation Anywhere is Java. Academy. The Academy is quite robust, offering several courses, so there are no issues with it. Certifications Automation Anywhere offers both free and paid certifications, and I believe they need to be renewed annually, if I'm not mistaken. 
accessibility. We can access automation anywhere from the web, which give us the freedom to access it on various devices, whether they are desktop, mobile, tablets, and so on. Price. Like other competitors such as UiPath, prices are not directly listed on their website. I found the following resource where I also gathered the information about UiPath. It states that the license for small businesses costs $9,000 annually. This license provides access for one user to the control room, one user to run unattended robots, one user to create robots. Up to five users can initiate calls to run an unattended robot and they can only run once per call. Up to five users can initiate calls to run an attended robot and up to 10 users have access to robot statistics or bot insight. They also have access to a store and libraries with campaigns created by the developer community and access to the Automation Anywhere application. However, I don't have a way to verify and cross-check this information, so I'd appreciate it if you could share in the comments if you have more information about Automation Anywhere's pricing. This is the comparison between the four market leaders in RPA, and you will decide which one you prefer, UiPath, Automation Anywhere, Blue Prison, or Power Automate. In my personal opinion, I like UiPath and Blue Prison for development, because it's very easy to work with them. I know a lot about C Sharp and Visual Basic .NET, so I feel very comfortable building solutions there. However, the pricing aspect can impact many companies. If I had to make a decision based solely on price, I would go for Power Automate because it offers transparency and displays all the prices directly on the website, which I find quite competitive. But there's a catch. I've tried Power Automate for development and honestly, it doesn't feel very comfortable for the development. It seems to lack certain functionality in its RPA tool. Clearly, someone who is an expert in Power Automate will be able to solve anything with it. Automation Anywhere is somewhat similar to this regard. I'm not an expert in Automation Anywhere, so I find it a bit challenging to use, primarily because of data manipulation with the Java programming language. I don't know Java, I know C Sharp and Visual Basic.net, as well as a bit of Python. So handling complex data in Automation Anywhere will require a stepper learning curve for me. On the other hand, in terms of functionality, it is excellent. Everything can be done directly from the cloud, which is a completely radical and different approach from what the other competitors are doing. I quite like that innovation component, but it ultimately depends on each company and individual. Each company or person has a unique situation. For example, I have a selection criteria based on budget, development conform, academy resources, community support, and more. But as a company or individual, you will have entirely different criteria. I hope you found this comparison interesting. If you did, please let me know your favorite RPA tool in the comments, like, share it with others, and subscribe to this channel. See you in the next videos.